So quite possibly the best thing going on nationally in sports is the Michael Jordan documentary, The Last Dance. You know, Jordan came here in November of 1982, and a fellow by the name of Steve Stepanovich in the University of Missouri got the last laugh that night. He started to get some of that. The date was November 27, 1982. Michael Jordan in North Carolina had won the national title eight months earlier. But the Mizzou All-American Steve Stepanovich was magical. The Tigers made 11 of their first 13 shots. Stepo finished with a game-high 22 to Jordan's 13, and Mizzou won 64 to 60. Stepo had a good feeling before the game. I just remember calling my dad before the game and, and telling him, because Coach Stewart did, had a really good defensive game plan. And we were going to double uh, on certain situations. I remember calling my dad and said, Dad, watch for this, because this is what we're going to do. We said, I think it's a really good idea. Therefore, I am looking forward to playing for Coach North Stewart and the University of Missouri Tigers. Going to Mizzou after back-to-back -back state titles and a 60-game win streak at DeSmet was also a good idea. Stipo won 100 games in Columbia, four Big A titles, and left as the all-time leading scorer, rebounder, and shot blocker. He was rare, a skilled seven-footer. I've maximized my, my God-given basketball skills that I was given. And I, I worked really hard. I always thought that I had to work harder than the next guy that had more talent. Stipo had a wonderful five-year stretch in the NBA. He had a 30-point game against Kareem Abdul-Jabbar and a triple-double against the Celtics and scored over 5,000 points. But a knee injury ended his career after five seasons. Stipo gets it back. Jordan popped out. Oh, and he did run into that fellow Michael Jordan quite a few times in the NBA also. And so I switched on Jordan, and they lobbed it to him. He dunked the ball on me, hit me in the head, and bounced from the stands. And it was very embarrassing. So the key was not to get embarrassed uh, on any highlight film uh, because of uh, his dunking over you. By the way, our smart aleck editor on that story, Joe Eichmeyer, included me in that piece. You can go back and watch it for about three seconds. He did it to make fun of me. With our producer, Andy Moeller, who's not a smart aleck, I'm Frank Cusimano. Let's send it back to the station.